What's up, Twisties? It's Twisted Pandora, and welcome back to another episode in the wonderful world of Roblox featuring the brand new universe event for 2018. So come on in and join your cyborg host and his trusty psychic, Mr. Bob and Cyrod, as we're gonna play Gravity Shift today. We played earlier Summoner Tycoon and we got the alien backpack from there, but now we're gonna play some Gravity Shift in the second episode of this great event today. And this one, I I really really love playing i actually have beaten gravity shift already so this is going to be valuable experience for when i go in but before i do be sure to drop a like down below subscribe if you guys are new to the channel and let's click play and hop right into some gravity shift welcome the mission for today is to find and collect the glowing cubes on the new universe event levels so as you guys can see i'm currently at the end level 18 of the entire map i have beaten everything that the is to be beaten in the normal gravity shift but we don't need to do that because we just go to teleport then scroll down all the way to universe events now this one is in a different location entirely so you don't have to worry about completing any of the normal missions but i highly highly recommend if you want to play some gravity shift and you're totally new to this game play a few levels through the normal ones it'll get you some training it teaches you like a beginner course almost through the middle but for right now we can go and complete this event by using the power of gravity let's grab this cube so we have cube number one we have to collect 21 more cubes and let's just choose this pathway I don't think they're really in order so it's gonna be great also I have double jump you have to purchase that in the store so if you guys see me double jumping a lot don't do that because it won't work for you we got number 12 let's keep going on this red track we're gonna just follow the red track all the way to the end and then obviously it's gonna switch different colors gravity helps you and it also goes against you so you gotta make sure you time these jumps and time all this properly and double Double jump again helps me a lot. So if you guys have a bit of Robux, I highly recommend grabbing some double jump. Oh geez, that that camera switch there. Number 10. All right, camera switch again. And we're going down over here. This part can get a bit complicated if you're new, but uh, it's nothing for us who's played gravity shift already. Watch this switcheroo. And then we're gonna jump along over here and another switcheroo hitting cube number four. This red path is super long. Oh my gosh. Oh, someone just ended up flying out. And now we are at cube number 21. Is there any more cubes that I should grab? There, there are a lot more cubes, but I'm thinking maybe I should grab the white one. Mm, you know what? Let's just go red. Let's just keep going red. Go red until the end, and that's the way we got to do this. Okay, so there's a bit of a jump here. This is not too hard. Just zoom in a bit if you guys are, you know. Ah! Oh, oh gosh. Oh gosh, I swapped there a bit. That was... Okay, okay, we, we're not supposed to swap. There we go. Oh gosh, I was so close. Make sure you don't swap there because that's not what you're supposed to do. It's not on the same side as the cube. So if you do that, you're going to end up flying off and that's not going to be good at all. Number 11 is ours now. If I look closely at the bottom left, I've noticed that every cube I've gotten has like a red hinge. So I assume that there are three more red cubes that I need to grab. Now the problem is, where is this? Do I jump on this side here? Let's hope it is. And number 16 is waiting there for me, bringing us to a total of six seven of the 22 cubes now keep in mind guys you can go on any which way possible it doesn't really matter which way you go but i'm just following the way i think is the best let's just go down let's see if there's a way we can flip around and hit oh there is right over here okay oh thankfully number seven and that only leaves one more red cube for us guys and then we can move on to another track red does seem to be the longest track here so if you follow red you'll get almost half of all the cubes available so that's why i think you guys should follow the way i do and now we're gonna go into oh gosh dang oh my goodness i almost fell off <laughs> you don't want to fall off especially when you're this far at the end and here we go wait oh gosh oh gosh wait there's there's a i think do i have it? <gasps> no there it is there is a cube on the opposite side of what I thought it was. There we go. Ladies and gentlemen, we have gotten all of the cubes on the red side. Now, you know what? Let's go purple. All right, purple. Where are you going to lead us? You, you have a total of two cubes. This is where things are going to get a bit more complicated. I think red was more of the trainer's course. Now we're going to switch around and get that number 14. That makes us have one of the orbs and we're going to fall in the Vesca over here. Or maybe not. I don't know where that Nevesca is going, but we got to make it to the end of this purple track to get ourselves our second flip around gravity power how far do i gotta go for this purple one how far we get a little switch and now we're gonna go around the outside make sure you don't fall off this because if you jump you're gonna go flying 
out of here. Oh, wait, it continues on. I remember this part when, oh, geez, in the red path. All right, okay, so it continues on. Down the hill we go. It's gonna do a little switch, so don't get alarmed. You always gotta watch out for those camera angle switches. Those things were probably the most complicated things to worry about when you do play this game. But for the most part, it shouldn't be too hard for you guys because all these maps do seem pretty easy compared to the normal maps. Got number 17. Now let's move on to the more complicated white ones. Oh my gosh. These ones got turning platforms. So watch out. Also got obstacles in the way. Here we go. Just go under. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. And well, that was my first fail of the day, guys. And I'm going to die. I'm back though. They can lead you astray here. So we're going to just jump over it. Yep. Like that. I was wondering if I could go under it, but I think that's not as wise as just jumping over it. We got cube number 22. All that remains is cube number, I believe it's a nine over here. Oh, we got a spinner. Oh, okay. You're gonna complicate this a bit here. Mm -hmm. And we jump. And then we gotta wait. 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 And jump. And now a gravity swap. Boom. Left is right. Up is down. You guys know how it is. Okay, this one we gotta dodge. Oh, we gotta. Okay, you know what? Double jump really helps here. Don't get caught by any of those bars. What is going on here? I don't. Okay, it's just see through. Okay, Ooh, that scared me. Oh, oh, these ones disappear after a short amount of time. So be sure to be fast on those. I forgot about those things. They exist. Now, this part, I don't know if that's meant to be hard because it's just trippy and now we're gonna just follow this one follow this one yep 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 and there we made it what well i don't know where the other white white one is so instead what we're gonna do is follow this track of blue because we haven't gotten any blue this way is probably the best way to go and we're just gonna make our way up here there is a white spin over here well it doesn't seem like there's anything too complicated here so what we're gonna do is go across onto this platform here and i know it connects to another blue one down there and i don't know if i should go back to it i think i should so here we go let's grab this blue one right over here and boom there we go there's also another blue one, but that just fades into the red. So let's go on back onto the spinner and go through the other way, which is this one right over here. So it's not too hard when you're on these spinner things. And then, hey, oh, there's a little thing that says wrong side. So if you get there, then you know it's the wrong side. Please try again later. Okay, this is where we got to go. I know that there's a blue one coming up here. Oh, yes. This little switcheroo. Bing. Okay. And we go over here. This is not getting too hard. We got a number 15 here. And there we go. We got the two blue ones. Four cyan, three yellow, and one white. I don't know where the white one is. I I really don't know. Okay. Let's go and find a cyan one. Let's reset. Oh, I do see one over there. Can I jump to that one? Ah, ah, yes, yes, yes. We, we, we made it. Wait a minute. I might be able to get back up. Oh, wait. Just flop like that. Yes, flop like that. Oh, oh, got this. Oh, yes, I did it. Haha, -ha, I don't know what I... <laughs> don't try to what I did there, because I really don't know what I did there. But if you do want to try it, then go on ahead. I'm just trying to show you guys the fastest and quickest way to do all this stuff, even though this video is already pretty long in of itself. We can just go across as quickly as possible. So these ones, you don't want to get caught by them either, because they'll flip you along, and then it'll be kind of awkward. Oh, gosh, these are moving. I didn't even expect that. Oh, we made it to number 13 now let's go and finish the cyan because i do believe that there's more waiting for there for oh, 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 he, oh, oh good thing these don't move good thing they don't move and then we just go like that and then this one spins around oh do we have to spin around that is a question wait a minute we're at the end of the we're at the end of the sign already no I, oh there's more up that way ah wait there's a yellow connector right over there we haven't got any of those right no we have not okay that's perfect guys so once you go through the sign go up the red go up to this purple and then we have to go all the way there and here we are number 14 we already got but we don't have anything in the yellow this yellow path does seem to be pretty long which works out really great for us here and we're just going to jump across to this one because <laughs> we can skip through these the yellow one does seem to be the most intense by my looks well i mean oh in terms of switches like oh my goodness how many switches are you gonna do in one little level come on yellow man wait no i'm blue man okay but i gotta complete this yellow test pick it up speed but it's okay not enough speed to knock me off and now we made it to our first yellow one number 20 we can go across and do a little switch hello old friend and goodbye old friend he just left me leaves us oh these ones okay these are gonna do yeah you're gonna do a lot of 90 degree turns here guys so don't go too fast on this or else you're gonna go flying off and then you're gonna have to start back at the bottom there and i don't want to do that no one wants to do that so here we go and just flop back down then flop over here and then oh wait wrong side i almost went the wrong side and we got number 18 okay which way goes back which way goes forward this way goes on to this we don't need to do that we need to go and find ourselves the last yellow piece and that's exactly what we're gonna do by following this path 
all the way back down. Oh gosh, all the way down. <laughs> I almost, oh, where are you? Goodbye. <laughs> he just jumped off and almost killed himself. Wait, couldn't we just jump up here? Ah, little cheat code. We don't have to flip around for this one because we got number five. We are currently at 19 out of 22. We just need two cyan and one white. I don't know where those ones are. Oh, there's another cyan path this way. Okay, when you get to this point, you're going to have to retrace your steps a bit here. And it kind of gets annoying because you're going to go all the way back here. And let's see. We can use this to connect to the white little spinner over here, which will connect to the other cyan part. I don't know why the two sign parts are separate from each other that's kind of annoying wait a minute there's a white little section here that we haven't touched at all what if you guys are thinking what i'm thinking i'm thinking that this is the new place this is the place where there's the white cube why are they separated most of them are joined together but it seems like the cyan and the white are split into two different parts so if you are missing cyan or white make sure you find both parts oh gosh oh gosh oh gosh Oh my gosh, there we go, we did it, we somehow did that. <laughs> I don't know what I did there. Oh, invisible, yes, this is definitely the one we haven't done. And uh, we're gonna go cross and hit that number nine. There we go, the white one that we were missing. We gotta make our way back now because we gotta go to the yellow connector over here. And as you can, oh gosh, oh gosh, wow. Oh jeez, here we go, here we go. Oh, what the, no, no, oh, okay, we made it. We somehow did that. Okay, back to the yellow. So this little connector with the white one on this side, this side section over here across the wheel is the one we've already done this one over here that's attached to the red and yellow we have not done so the easiest way would have to go back all the way through the flipper but let's just skip across like that using our double jump technique and now we're gonna make our way to the box number 20 once you guys see this 20 box that means you're on the last cyan part here you gotta watch out this one is a lot more complicated than the last cyan part because there's a lot of places that you can go and turn yourself around and that's oh whoa whoa Oh, and we made it. Oh, gosh. Lisa's, hey, old friend. We meet again. We got number three. Look at that. Number three is ready there for us. Look at him. He's mocking us because we can't even get to there. But we can with the power of double jump. Lisa, say hey, welcome back, my dude. Oh, yes. And now let's go get number six. The final frontier is upon us, ladies and gentlemen. As soon as we get across here, we're going to get it. Come on. Oh, here we go. I have a good feeling about this. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, we got a spinner over here. A spin flip. Oh, oh, okay, one that loses. Whoa, 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 don't leave me. Yes, we made it to number six. Congratulations, you did it. We have got the All Cubes Collected Award and the Hat of the Void. And now this will bring us to the end of this episode of Gravity Shift in the Universe event. If you guys enjoyed and if this helped you out, be sure to drop a like down below and subscribe if you guys are new to the channel. Again, you don't have to follow my specific path, but it was pretty easy except for the fact the cyan and white parts are kind of split, which gets annoying. But anyways, guys, we did it in the end. It's not too hard as long as you know how to play around with gravity and make it bend to your rules. But anyways, guys, we'll see you later for tonight's last episode in this universe event. This is Twisted Pandora signing off. And as always, don't forget to stay snazzy!